Welcome to the Lemon Lane Stretch of the series preview of the upcoming series with the Reds. Uh, my name is Alex Schneider with my good friend and co-host. My name is Paul Evie. Uh We're going to do the preview, like I said, for the Reds. Um, so I'll let you start it off, Paul. Or no, I'll start it off because it is at the Reds. Um, so the starters for the Cardinals are going to be Adam Wainwright, Michael Waka, and Mike Leak. And for the Cincinnati Reds, it is going to be Dan Straley, uh, Cody Reed, and Brandon Finnegan. Um, injuries to report for the Cardinals. None that I can think of as of right now. We just did a podcast, a Cardinals podcast, not too long ago. We uh, There could be an injury to Jaime with the start he had yesterday. We are not sure. You guys will know about that as soon as it comes out. Um, but other than that, there are new, no new injuries to report. Obviously, Carpenter, Moss, and uh, Peralta are all still hurt as of right now. Um, but they are on their way back. Carpenter is going on a rehab assignment, and Moss should be back, and Peralta should be back uh, this week. Okay, so they will return here soon. But other than that, there are no new injuries. Uh, for the Reds, I don't have anything important. Uh, Devin Mezzarocco, their catcher from the beginning of the season, was hurt. Uh, in May, um, so that's kind of old news. Um, that's it, to be honest with you. Uh, Alfredo Simon has been out um, for a while, for about a month, uh, but he's not coming back for the Cardinals series, so you don't have to worry about that. Who's been hot recently for your St. Louis Cardinals? I'm going to go with a shocker pick right now. Colton Wong has been uh, scorching on fire uh, here as of late. Um, which is great to see. Um, who's not hot? I really can't name anybody. Everybody's pretty much hitting pretty well, unless you have somebody there, Paul. I Randall Gritchick hasn't been all that great lately. Um, his his numbers the past couple weeks have been pretty disappointing. But other than that, uh, yeah, you're. And Tommy exactly Fams right. kind of Tommy Fams kind of blinded everybody of what he's been doing, but mm -hmm. he'll get right eventually, hopefully. Um, but other than, I guess, Gritchick's struggles, everybody else has been pretty much on fire. Yadier Molina has been coming out of his own here recently, hitting doubles. He had a home run the other day. I got to watch that. That was really cool. Um, but, yeah. Uh, for the Reds, uh, who's hot is Joey Votto. The last time the Cardinals saw the Reds, he wasn't doing much of anything. And in the month of July, he's had a big resurgence. Uh, in July, he's been batting 417. He only has four home runs, but he is doing his typical average and OBP thing where he just hits the ball and gets on base and draw walks. Um, and he does have 12 RBIs in July as well. Uh, so he is looking more like Joey Votto that we all know and love. Uh, as for who's not so hot for the Reds, um, I'm going to go with their catcher position. Uh, Devin Mezzarocco started the season, and he, if he was able to stay healthy, he probably would have been pretty good. But he, he did not stay healthy. And now their catcher is Tucker Barnhart. Um, he's doing okay. Um, he's batting 252 with five home runs uh, and 26 RBIs. But I don't – I have not heard much of him defensively. So I, I don't – I'm not of the belief that he's one of the premier de defensive catchers. Uh, but, but the Reds lineup is actually pretty good. Um, but I'd go with their catcher position. Okay, and then the series uh, – uh, what was I going to say? Man. Prediction. prediction. Series prediction. Sorry about that. Um, I'm going to go with a, a Cardinals series win, a 2-1 to one win against the Reds. I think we have some a three, a three really good pitchers starting out this weekend. Um, so I think that that gives us a really, really big fighting chance against the three uh, starters that – Cincinnati's kind of throwing out there. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna go with you with the Cardinals series win, but I'm gonna go with a sweep. Uh, I think if there's Ooh. one game, that, I think if there's one game that the Cardinals could lose, it'd be the first game because Dan Straley's a pretty decent pitcher. Um, but the Reds' pitching is not is not very good, and the Cardinals have the best record in the league on the road. Um, the Cardinals need to win this series, wipe the floor with the Reds, get them out of the way. They're not any good. Just don't don't screw around with them. And I think that's what the Cardinals will do. I'm going to go with a series sweep. Um, Alex, if you don't have anything, that'll do it for uh, for this series um, series preview. No, I'm, I'm done.
Cool. Then uh, that'll do it for us. Uh, we'll be back uh, later on this week when the Cardinals uh, come back to St. Louis. But uh, until then, this is the 11th inning stretch. Thank you for joining us.